Well, hi there. I hope Chef Adam, I guess. Welcome to my channel. This is the first video to this channel. So today I thought I'd walk you through how to make some English muffins. Let's do it. Alright, let's do it. No, I don't like to follow recipes or anything, I just kind of look at the recipe and then guess. I don't really follow it step by step. Watch a YouTube video on how to make them. Let's, uh, let's figure this out. Alright, we gotta activate the yeast. I got a bowl. Toss this in the microwave. Mm. Alright, I got the wooden spoon here. Spoon for mixing. We're just gonna let her go. Okay. Add the butter. Liquid yeast mixture. Get all that in there. We're mixing. Oh no. Oh dear, the dough's too sticky. All right, let's get this bowl and let's oil it up. That dough from sticking. Okay, covering the whole thing in oil here. So it doesn't stick. Okay, that's what it looks like. So we're just gonna let this dough sit in the bowl now. And one hour later, Look at that dough, jiggly. All right, so now we're going to cut the dough into little circles, the shape of English muffins, and put them on the pan and let them rise again. Let's get all this dough out here. There. So now you can get anything that's round as a nice little cutting thing. Look at this little this jug, this cup, has this nice little circle, why not? Let's just flatten it out. I don't have a rolling pin, what do I do? Why? So now we're just gonna cut these little circles, like that, little English muffin doughs. What do you think? All right, so the dough has risen. As you can see, they're a little bit more poofy. And we're gonna cook these on the pan now. So we're gonna throw these on the pan and cook them up and get some muffins. And let's do it. Okay, I got my wide pan like that. With the lid to help keep the moisture in. Ooh, 
are getting poofy. The last batch in, and there you have it. Lovely English muffins. That is a great English muffin. Well, thanks for watching. Um, make sure to subscribe to the new channel. Um, leave me a comment on what you'd like to see me cook next. And yeah, just thanks for watching. Cheers.